In today's video, we will cover how to complete the keycard puzzle at the power plant in Rust. To complete the puzzle, you will need a green keycard, a blue keycard, one electric fuse, and I do recommend going in with a rad suit. The first switch to complete the puzzle is on the side of the building with the mechanical lift doors on the corner across from the broken cooling tower. The second switch is diagonally across the monument from the first switch in the small building with the slanted roof and refinery, and the puzzle doors are on the building at the center of the monument. For the first switch, make your way up the stairwell on the side of the building with the mechanical lift doors, and you'll find the switch on the generator on the side of the building. Jump over the railing and make your way diagonally across to the second building. Make your way into the building with the slanted roof and you'll find the second switch. Activate that and then turn on the timer and then work your way to the puzzle building in the center. There are a couple of green keycard doors that'll now be lit up and we're gonna go into the first one. Once in the building, wrap around to the back corner and you will find a switch on the side of one of the generators. Hit that switch and then head back to the front area of the building to what looks like a lobby area and go up the set of stairs. From there, keep working left and then head up to the third floor and then hook a left past the blue door and you'll find a fuse box. Drop your fuse in to light up the blue door and then head back to it with your blue key card and go ahead and swipe and you'll be in. Once in the blue key card room, you'll find a set of stairs. Head up those stairs and you will find a red key card on the desk. With that, there is a set of crates on this floor that you can loot. And then you can head back down and there is a second blue door you can leave this room from. You will have plenty left on your fuse if you had a fresh fuse, if you want to grab it to reuse again later. There is also a recycler you'll be able to use on this floor. To leave, you do have the option of going up these stairs to the green door up here if you have somebody waiting in a mini chopper or can afford fall damage. Otherwise, head back down to one of the two green doors on the first floor or enter the sewer area and you will find another green door that you can leave from. With that, thank you for watching. I hope you found this helpful. If so, let me know and I'll be looking to make more of these in the future.